Canadians are back at the Sims 4 City Life. If you're wondering why Karina, McKenna, and Kanika are back home, well, I'm going to go ahead and let Karina explain what's going on. Go ahead, Karina. Yeah, we had to show, we had to cut that show, a trip short because. <laughs> I'm sorry. Jimmy got a jo a undercover job. He had to go to another town. He had to go to another town. Well, they didn't want to take the kids. <laughs> I guess she's still upset by her mom and dad leaving. But anyway, they couldn't take the kids with them. And it's a dangerous job. It, but Kathy, she she refused to stay here. She had to be with her husband. So right now, I got all the kids, but even the little one, so... Which I, I'm taking care of all the kids, which I always did anyway. They always work so much, it's ridiculous, but... Anyway, they're gonna come visit and stuff off and on when they can, but... And you they know, took, for a little while... And they I'm, took Pinky. Yeah, they took the cat, too, because Kathy loves that cat. Yeah, the little bitch is a sick, Karina. Oh, I gotta take him to the bed. Anyway, so I got all, I got the three kids, which we know. I got my <clears throat> She's grown, but the other two, one's in high school, and he's just a little toddler. But I've taken care of kids before, so I'll be fine. Uh, yeah, I gotta take him to the bed. Your dog just puked in the floor, and you stepped oh in it. Oh my god, you alright? Let's go, let's go ahead and get, get you to the bed and see what's going on. All right, Karina, you had to go all the way to Brittleton Bay. And there's so this vet is singing. What the heck is going on? Are you confused? Usually, yes. Now, dog, where do you go? Um, this dog is steaming. Oh. <laughs> Plus. <laughs> oh, oh, never mind. I was like, what in the world? Oh, she's has she's frozen. No wonder. It's easy. My dog is here. He's throwing up. I don't know what's wrong with him. I go ahead and check in. Poor, poor Rosie. She's blue. She's ice blue. No wonder I saw smoke coming off of her. She's frozen. Poor thing. Money, bitches! Oh my god, what kind of hair do you have, sir? Rolando Booth? It's just a beaver here. Uh, Karina. Yes? What do you say about him and his Justin Bieber hair? I guess whatever floats his boat. Whatever, dude. Uh. <laughs> Whatever you prefer. Oh, there's a singing vet. He came back in. I guess he wants to be a singer, but he, he he's a vet right now. Uh, Karina, are you going to sit down? There's a big dog right here. I, rag time. I wonder how little Britches got sick. I had no idea. He was fine before. Oh, of course, I didn't take him with me, so who knows what they fed him. I told her to feed him them special dog food. But God knows what they probably gave him. I guess you're going... Where are you going, Karina? Are you going back there? Hey, my sweetie. Oh, you're going with the singing vet. Uh-oh. Oh. Alright, what do you see about him? You think nothing now. He's good looking. My dog got sick this morning. He threw up. I don't know what's wrong with him. Oh. Sir, do you have a voice? Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, Me! What the heck? Uh, all he needed was a ride on the table? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I think that man's crazy. Oh. My dog is sick. You put him on the table, he goes up and down, and he gets up. Is, is that a cure? Sir? Yeah? Are you hot?
boy. Oh my god, baby. Did somebody hit hit my dog? Yeah, he housed up. I don't know what. My dog is still sick. <laughs> Your dog just threw up. <clears throat> then why he just standing there? Yes, it did. Hang on, Karina. Let's try this again. I don't know what to think about this place. Oh, nay! Uh, is she gonna mop up the throw up? My dog is sick. He puking! Exclamation point! Give me somebody a house up hell! Is he got taken care of? Oh, for you. Oh, huh? Uh huh. Give Z. <laughs> oh God, help me! <laughs> Mommy's right here, little bitches. I really had to come back to him again. Yeah, okay, he's on the table. Let's see what happened. Is the heartbeat normal? Looks like he's dizzy. It's swamp, super duper swamp mouth. How the heck are you dead? You can use the basic trim or expensive. That one expensive. Maybe not my money. Yourself. There you go. You thought I had more than that. Nope, you had around that amount. Uh, okay. Well, your dog's cured. Ah, right, then we're gonna go now. Thanks, I think. I don't know what to say. I'm glad he's not sticky, man. Come on, little bitches. Gotta go home. Alright, Little Bridges is better now, and Grim Reaper replies I got your multicolored crew socks in the mail. By any chance, was this supposed to be edible? Asking for a friend. What the heck? So the Grim Reaper wants to eat McKenna's socks that she made? Okay. Um, death? Yes. Why do you want to eat the socks? Well, they're made of candy. Just because they're multicolored? Yeah. Uh. You eat them if you want, I guess. I don't know. McKenna's cooking. Okay. I don't know what she's fixing. Oh, she's making grilled chicken. Make because everybody's hungry. Yeah. Well, except Kanika's not hungry right now. Alright. Yeah, she'd be really excited about starting her job Monday. Why'd they go in there now, Bo? They can play with Walden. <laughs> I don't know why it's down there. I have no idea. <laughs> Are the kids okay with their parents being gone? <coughs> They've been sad today. You gonna dance? I don't care. Let me see you dance. It's good, honey. You didn't get. Well, didn't seem to be in a happy mood today. He's feeling energized. Yeah, he likes chicken. Uh, <clears throat> he's excited about it. Mm. 
Poor little britches is feeling tired. Yeah, she had a big day today. Poor little thing. How do you feel about your daughter and son-in-law being gone? I miss him. But, I mean, he had to do it, so, you know, it happens. They're located in Strangerville. Uh, no wonder. Yeah, that place <coughs> is really kooky. <coughs> <coughs> I think I'll be there for a while. How long do you think they're going to be there? He don't know. He's going to keep in touch. <coughs> He's going to call on the computer here and then. They said whenever they, you know, they could, they come stop and see the kids, especially the littlest one. And yeah, they need to, because he's little, so. They, they did call me early and tell me they got everything alright, moved in and stuff. She had to get a longer commute to work, but it, she said it's okay. There's going to be a festival coming up. Yeah. Thanks for picking the chicken, honey. I appreciate it. <clears throat> the Festival of Snow? Oh, the Romance... Oh, the Festival of Snow started in Mount Komorebi, but the Romance Festival is going to be at 5 p.m. Oh. Romance Festival is more to do. I'm glad you're back home anyway, so... <laughs> it's all the things broken in the world. Except for the bathroom. I don't know. You want to go to the romance festival today, or what do you want to do today, Karina? Nah, I don't know. I don't have no romance. What's well, so nice to go to the festivals? The kid does. I don't know. Maybe she might want to go with her boyfriend. It's a Nick. It's a Nick who wants to go. I go with her. Is that to her? Oh, here's and Jacob. But I'm um, ready to What were you going to say? I was going to say, unless the kid and them want us to go. Oh, Jeremy texted. I guess he heard about the job. That's good. He's congratulated on, on the new job. That's nice. Who's calling now? Jacob, you're already here! This makes no sense. Mm, boy, it's that me, ain't they? You're ill. Um, Walden, well, I guess got full. Oh, the quality's excellent. But you have a little bitch, he's uncomfortable. <laughs> little Britches is in Walden's room. I don't know. Maybe we'll have to go to the bathroom. I don't know. Oh. Um, Karina! Boy, I tell you what! <clears throat> um, there's no trash cans. Um, now your dog's feeling better. I wonder why. Don't play in it. Hey, good boy. This romance festival. Oh, you don't. Oh, you, you don't have to travel to it literally. You can just go right outside your right out, outside your place and go. <clears throat> oh, Lord, I'd fly in here. Ugh, nasty. Well, your dog feels better now. 
went missing, gave him diarrhea. Probably. Oh god. What the heck? I think Little Britches is a girl. Whatever! <laughs> I just said, think Little Britches is a girl. Because at the vet it says something about Spain. Why she be in love? Uh, I think she wants to... I think she's in heat. Uh, that's probably why. Can you lecture about indoor potty? Yeah. I don't know where you are, but... You guess whoever's closest can do it? I guess you're gonna do it too. What do you have to tell her? Young lady, I will whoop your hind in if you put my uh -oh. feet in his ass again. Uh -oh. You understand me, young uh -oh. woman? Don't you do it no more. Stand boop it up. You know, Betty, you know I go outside. Uh -oh. <sighs> Come on, uh -oh. Betty. Uh -oh. She growl at you. Don't you growl at me, young lady. Wanji? The second A. Uh, uh. Oh. <laughs> You're real. Yeah, she's angry. <laughs> Can you tell she's not really happy? Ah, gross. <laughs> now she's better. I'm sorry, Karina, that happened. It happened. Right, where's the festival? Oh, it's right over here. <clears throat> Hi, Caleb. Hey. Romance guru is. You have any idea? You better hear me in here somewhere. I don't know. I guess I'll wait and see. You get slow. You're always beating them, it seems like. What did you think about Mount Komarevi when you went? I wish I didn't have to leave, but we had to. I was loving it then, and the girls were too. Maybe we can go back sometime. Maybe when Wally gets a little bit bigger, we can take him and snowboard or something. He can sled as a toddler, though, but not much else. Well, maybe we go back. Is it nice to be home now? Oh, there's, yeah. Oh, there's I a do. romance guru. Gideon Hill Brand? I don't know. Kathy's here. What in the world? She doing here. Is it that settling over there? Is Jeremy hit you? <laughs> Ask her. 
I don't see Jeremy. Oh, there's it. Jeremy. <clears throat> I have no idea what's in his hair. They're both here. Maybe then it could he. I don't know. Let's say they just stopped here and then. They say they just wanted to come. I have no idea what's in his hair. What? I have no idea either. Maybe part of this row. I have no idea what he did. When that came when he left. Wanna ask him? Yeah. <clears throat> uh, he's undercover. He's investigating somebody here. Oh. He's trying to fit him in the crowd. So there's someone suspicious here too that he's dealing with? That's true. Well, actually, they don't live here, but they came here to the romance fits. Oh, no. She's talking to you. She's talking to Darling Moth. Oh, okay. <laughs> Must be a friend from school. <laughs> I, should, I guess Jeremy had to go. Yeah, the get person they were watching was. Who were they watching? I don't know. He won't tell me. It's it's it, it the king. That makes sense. What's wrong with her? She looks like she was really upset me because her dad left. Is she very flirty? But it looks like she was crying too. Wow. Maybe boyfriend. I don't know where Jacob went. But he came with us. He was at your place. <coughs> That's great. No, I guess Jacob went back home. Yeah. What does everyone want to do? There's an area to paint. Wanna try that? Mind that. Everybody can do a flirty painting. I have no idea what kind of painting this is, but it's interesting. That's you. Well, <clears throat> I don't know what your painting skill is, but... I guess make it sell this death. Oh, this guy. Oh, he's a teenager. He's selling his painting. I've never seen this painting before. I do love that painting. I love to have that one. That's beautiful. What do you want for it? 179. I think I'll go ahead and buy it. Okay, for some reason, won't let me click on it. My not? I don't know. Oh, he's not tending the table. No wonder. He just put them there. He didn't want to sell them that bad, Dean. I don't understand why <laughs> this one's really beautiful. Pretty. I'd like to have it. Who painted it? Oh. Uh, Rohan so. Elderberry? He didn't want to sell it? I thought he did, but... <laughs> Oh, no, he, it says 10 table. He's not tending it. 
Oh, you put them up there and just stay in there. Well, I, yeah, well, I guess they decided she can go buy it then, Karina. Yeah, I would like to have it, yeah, man. If you ever decide to say that I'm right here. He is, he is Ekram and Eleanor's grandson. I know who he is. Well, I figured you knew, because you're a psychic anyway. Well, I hope he decides to sell it. This one, I guess, is fruit and stuff, and I don't know what this one is. Thank you. I've never seen these paintings before. I guess they're new. But I really love this one. Yibikoi, oh, now he's selling it. Go ahead, Karina. I'm on Sabino. I guess he heard you. With you. 179. We're gonna take out three. 309 for that one. Now this one's 656. Huh? There you go. Hi, Eden. How about him, Mom? That was nice of you, Karina. I like him. You did, you did a good job, that sweetie. Support an artist. That's, that's what you like to do. Okay, even though I've been, I only like draw stick men. <laughs> well, of course you love to support everyone anyway, Karina, because that's how you are. Of course I do. This lady's painting uh, looks like a log cabin. Your painting looks cute. Yeah, this stick lady. It's still really cute, though. <laughs> With a little man. You can sell it for $88. I'm sure you sell. want to keep it. You can list it on Plopsy if you wanted to. Or you want to keep it? <coughs> uh, nah. You don't want to keep it? <sighs> you don't wanna keep it? <sighs> nah. You want to list Plopsy really cheap, Nicole? Um, you can list on Plopsy for $5. We Georgia. Mean it, Karina. All right, Dean. <sighs> See what people think. Here's what McKenna did. Yicky. So you can list hers on Plopsy. And this is what Kanika did. Uh. That's actually really beautiful. I did not know. Oh, it's poor? That's poor? I thought it looked really nice myself. Looks nice to me. I think Kanika has a natural talent for art. I think so too. What about list on Plopsy? Why not? Let's see what people think. I think that might be her calling art. What do you think? I think so. How about all of you going to eat then? Oh no. I think I, I think I recognize somebody. Oh. Oh yes, yeah, Siren Man! Siren Man! I knew I'd recognize someone. And there's Caleb. Hi Caleb! Hey, the cow. What's going on? What in the world, Dominic? What the heck do you... Why do you have this vampire steak? Uh, Caleb? He's near you! Uh-oh, time to go. Hurry up, buy my shit, I gotta leave. Some idiot tear the damn vampire steak. <laughs> Karina? he be alright. Hi, Siren Man. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good, too. <clears throat> Dang it, throat. <laughs> Buy my t-shirt. Oh, yeah. First I get stabbed. Is anybody buying your stuff, Caleb? Uh, not really. They're staring at like a bunch of goons. Maybe this lady would. Oh, it's Balko's wife. Yeah. Does she want it? I mean, your outfit looks cute, Octavia, but your boots don't match. That's actually a really cute combo, but no to the boots. I'm sorry, Octavia. I think everybody got the same thing. You see, we eat bits about a lot, don't we? It's been a nice night, I have to say. 
I think she got a t-shirt or something. She'd love more if you want one. Wait, like Karina. I don't know, I might get one of the guys might get one. I mean, I just give to the small business man. Caleb's always working his butt off it where he can make money. I like Caleb, he's sweet. Caleb is... What in the world is up with your hair, sir? It's blue! It's blue. He's a butt hoe, ain't he? I just said, what up, what's up with your hair? I didn't mean to offend. You cold, honey? Yeah, it's cold out here. We in a cold weather. Wait, can you get freezing to death? She's blue! Hurry! Did she she didn't even change, did she? Yeah, I I hope she did. Yeah, she did, but it's not showing up yet. <coughs> the Karina? Uh, well, I guess I can't get one now. Because the festival's over. Well. You snooze, you lose. Sorry, maybe next time. Wait, right, Karina. Yeah, I guess so. <coughs> <clears throat> what the heck? I saw Nancy. Oh. Bye, Siren Man. Oh. Goodbye! Bye, Caleb. Bye, honey. See you next time. That was disappointing, wasn't it, Karina? Yeah, it's alright. Maybe next time. You've got time. one, at least. Me, yeah, it's alright. She's still blue? No, she's not oh. blue anymore. Yeah, that was a romance girl I think you're seeing. <coughs> that was an interesting day, I have to say. Yes, it was. Well, it looks like Kanika doesn't have school or anything because it's Sunday. Walden's already asleep. That's good. It seemed like he wasn't throwing any fits with you today. He didn't really need to be upstairs by himself. Actually, he doesn't. Maybe I'll make that room that's got that pot pipe in there a bedroom. That's a good idea. We can transfer his bedroom down here. And that don't need to be in here anyway. I don't know why it's in <clears> there to you. It's been there for years. The okay. people that used to live here before I moved in, I think they had it, so back in them days. That makes sense. Yeah. Good night, Karina. Good night, everybody. Alright, thank you. Thank you all so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you hit the notification bell again. No part time upload. Yeah! I love you all so much. Bye! Bye, everybody. Bye! Bye, everybody. Goodbye everyone, it's Ed and the Ed Lions. I was only one of yours, it's Kevin Arnold. Thanks for telling me, Fred. You're welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye, it's Agar and Caleb.